Beaver Solutions is here at Farrah Pond doing some maintenance work on our drawdown mechanism. One year out of three we draw the pond down to combat invasive weeds, part of our integrated pest management program approved by the Conservation Commission and funded by the generous donations of residents around the pond who love this pond and want to keep it from eutrophication and losing it. Mike Callahan, president of Beaver Solutions, is constructing various mechanisms to put beaver deceiver pipes into a cage around the culvert, the outlet pipe, to allow us to draw the pond down even if the beavers object and attempt to block the pipe. And this fencing will stop the beavers from chewing on the pipe where it goes into the fence. Aha! Uh -huh. And they've constructed various cages, beaver domes. One will fit around the outlet pipe and these plastic, I guess they're plastic pipe, yep, polyethylene. polyethylene will feed into the main outlet cage and in turn be fed by smaller cages. You see one here, Devon is installing pontoons on the bottom of it so they can then float this pipe out to deeper water shove the near end into the main beaver dome cage and if all goes well they won't capsize Devon will survive the pontoons will be recovered and Mike will insert the near end into the main beaver dome affixing it with galvanized wire and then swim to safety at least that's the theory We'll see what happens. Stay tuned. All the pieces have been pre-cut. Holds have been made to accept the wire. Everything has been thought out in advance so that no step is wasted. We hope. Cement blocks are used to weight the poly pipe to keep it from floating up. And they are affixed with the galvanized wire. And this is actually cage number two of three. Right? Yeah, go to the right. This one's going to be the middle one. Okay. Devon will soon get out of his depth and have to depend on the pontoons. Yeah. Okay. The first one put in is about three feet to my right right now. 
Okay, good. If anything, go further away from it. Okay. This is tricky because the pipe is fixed in length. He's going to undo the forward pontoon carefully so as not to capsize the cage. Forward one is free. Alright. I'm gonna go try to swing forward. Okay. Mike is underwater. Trying to shove the open end of the pipe into the main beaver dome in a pre-cut hole. Whoops, whoops, Devin is having, Devin is having a problem with the okay. pontoon. Mike has got the pipe in. Okay, sink? Yeah, go ahead. Now Devin will free the... You probably want to release the other side first. This side? Yeah. The thing capsizes, they're in trouble. Yeah. Yeah. Up. Down it goes. Success. That's number two of three. Now he's standing. Devin is standing on that cage while he protects the pontoons and will use them to Swim home. That one's up. Sorry, I've gone another couple inches just because it's gotten rusted. Mike is dancing on an older cage to try to flatten it out. It's rusted. Try to submerge it. I believe, unless he's on the main one. No, he's on the main one. I don't know what he's doing. All right, that's two. They've been at it most of the day, constructing the cages and measuring. That's well, two. The water's noticeably warmer when you get into the yeah. shallow part. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>